Hello everybody. Today I am going to make a ESP programmer and this programmer will be able to program the ESP12E, ESP12, ESPF and ESP7. You know uh, when you use this type of ESP chip we have to solder it on the PCB like this and if I want to change the sketch we have to put some extra components over there on the board so we will be able to change the sketch. So I want uh, to make a separate programmer which directly will be able to put over there and then we will connect it with FTDI and we will be able to change the program of this ESP chip even we have soldered it. So make it done. I have developed this small PCB. I am going to use this 2mm header. Uh, since this uh, ESP uh, 12E is uh, having 2mm header required and this is a normal header it is uh, 0.1 inches as you know and I'm going to use this small very few components some of the resistance which will pull up or pull down the pin and a switch and a regulator 3.3 volt regulator which will convert the input power supply in 3.3 volt, a switch and a capacitor. So I'm going to solder all these components on this board and let's see how, how it works. Here it is, I've designed the layout of the PCB in the Eagle and here's the schematic. I have used uh, some capacitor and a 3.3 volt voltage regulator and some header pins some pull up pull down resistance and a switch so here you can see the design I'm going to develop this PCB and I'll make a programmer Here it is my ESP12, e, ESP12, ESP F and ESP7 programmer is ready and uh, you can see I uh, placed a uh, 2mm header over there in bottom and I will be able to directly connect this uh, programmer to the chip in this way and thereafter I will connect this header with the FTDI programmer and uh, you can see I have placed a switch over there and this switch is connected with GPIO 0 to pull up or pull down the GPIO 0. If we pull down the GPIO 0 it will be uh, working as a programmer and we will be able to flash the chip. If we make it pull up it will be working as a in a normal mode now you can see I am able to connect this uh, type of uh, board directly from this programmer. For the demo I am going to connect this ESP12E chip with the programmer and this ESP12E chip GPIO5 will be D1 uh, in the Arduino IDE so I am going to blink an LED on D1 because I'm going to use the Arduino IDE to put the sketch on this ESP12E. So let's see how it works. Here it is, the setup is ready to upload a sketch. I have provided an external power supply to this uh, programmer and uh, I have connected an ESP12E. And I want to blink an LED on uh, D1 so I have connected and LED. So now I'm going to upload the sketch using Arduino IDE and uh, here it it is going on it is compiling and you can see the blinking it is uploading and uh, on screen also you can see it is uploading the sketch and when it completes you will be able to see an LED will start blinking over there so we will indicate that the sketch is uploaded successfully 
here it is done and you can see an LED is blinking over there so in this way my this programmer is working fine I'm going to upload the required files in the description so you'll also be able to make the similar programmer to program the ESP12, ESP12E, ESP12F and ESP7 chips based on ESP8266. So thanks for watching.